Krishna is possessed of an unlimited intellect. Krishna is inaccessible to sensuous knowledge. Krishna is lord of the infinity of worlds. Krishna wields the power of creating the unlimited. Krishna carries the impress of limitless power. Krishna is possessed of inconceivable potency. Krishna is unborn. Krishna solves all heterogeneous views. Krishna is vanquished by exclusive devotion. Krishna is inner guide. Krishna is the beholder of the energy of the wicked. Krishna is the giver of salvation to jivas that are free from vanity. Krishna ordains the worldly course of conceited jivas. Krishna is primal god Deva. Krishna is primal person Purusha. Krishna is overwhelming flood of bliss. Krishna possesses fulfilled desire. Krishna is self-delighted. Krishna is the opponent of the sensuous. Krishna is sung by the best of hymns. Krishna is the dispeller of the night of pseudo-religion. Krishna is devoid of increase and decrease. Krishna is efficient and material cause. Krishna is the only truth. Krishna is avidar of the fruit of work. Krishna is not subject to the consequences of work. Krishna is the seer of cause and effect. Krishna is the person who is time. Krishna is time as own self. Krishna is even the time of time. Krishna is present in the heart of every animal entity, like fire inside food. Krishna is great food. Krishna is the augmenter, like the full moon of the ocean of earth, gods twice born and animals. Krishna is the tormentor of cannibalistic persons. Krishna is the destroyer of the pride of the arrogant. Krishna is the root cause of the origin, etc. of the world. Krishna is the cause of the world. Krishna is the creator of the world. Krishna appears as if possessed of a body like that of mundane entities, for the good of the world. Krishna is the guru, center of gravity, of the world. Krishna is the refuge, ashray, of jivas individual souls who are afraid of birth and death. Krishna is devoid of birth. Krishna is equally the internal guide, cause and director of jivas. Krishna is the destroyer of the miseries of persons who enjoy themselves in meditating upon him. Krishna is of the fourth dimension and self manifest. Krishna is worthy of being gifted. Krishna is the punisher of the wicked. Krishna is the god of gods. Krishna is really cognizable by the gods. Krishna is unconcerned about body, house, etc. Krishna is the supreme ruler of the greatest gods. Krishna is the exponent of religion. Krishna is the eternal son of Nanda. Krishna is visible to man with great difficulty. Krishna's presence marks the world of man. Krishna is the object of palatable drink of the human eye. Krishna is the internal guide of all. Krishna is worthy of the worship of all the worlds. Krishna accommodates all the worlds. Krishna is the manister of all life. Krishna is unstinted in giving himself away to one who recollects him. Krishna is the efficient cause. Krishna, although devoid of all mundane quality, assumes mundane qualities by his inconceivable power for the purposes of creation, etc. Krishna is not subject to change. Krishna is not capable of discrimination by reason of being void of any extraneous covering. Krishna is the giver of himself to those who covet nothing. Krishna loves those who covet nothing. Krishna does no work. Krishna is human, hidden primal person Purusha. Krishna is present in the hearts of Jivas like the five elements. Krishna is the supreme sorcerer. Krishna is supreme godhead and the internal guide of all. Krishna is the press jewel of those whose praises assume be the sacred law. Krishna is primal person and ever existing. Krishna is the highest among the objects of worship. Krishna is the healer of the miseries of the submissive. Krishna is the destroyer of the sins of the submissive. Krishna is the destroyer of the distress of the submissive. Krishna is the residue after the cataclysm. Krishna is devoid of touch with mundane senses. Krishna is the soul and friend of all animal entities. Krishna is devoid of distinction appertaining to an alien. Krishna is inconceivable by his nature. Krishna is the master of the universe. Krishna is the nourisher of the universe. Krishna is the sun that cheers the lotus of the kindred of the Krishnas. Krishna is the god worshipped by the Brahmanas. Krishna is the foremost of the Brahmanas. Krishna is the originator of Brahma. Krishna is the worshipped of Brahma. Krishna loves his devotees. Krishna wears forms in accordance with the wishes of his devotee. Krishna is eternally present in Mathura. Krishna is devoid of the sense of kinship and regards all in the same way. Krishna is beyond all measuring potency Maya. Krishna is subdued by the love of Judistira. Krishna is concealed by the screen of Maya from the sight of the people. Krishna does not follow the ways of the world. Krishna is the destroyer of the fear of the mundane sojourn of the submissive. Krishna is the womb of the scriptures. Krishna is the guru's own self. Krishna is the void of hankering for wife, offspring, etc. Krishna is the ordainer of the worldly sojourn and of the summer bonum. Krishna is the cause of all entities. Krishna is the friend of the two. Krishna is the void of discrimination as of kinship. Krishna is existence. Krishna possesses true nessa. Krishna is the true entity. Krishna is true of speech. Krishna is true of resolve. Krishna sees with an equal eye. Krishna is the cause of all causes. Krishna is the originator of all. Krishna is the soul's own self of all jivas individual souls. Krishna is omniscient. Krishna is all seeing. Krishna is the embodiment of all gods. Krishna is the seer of all. Krishna is the lord of all. Krishna is the snake ashray of all entities. Krishna is all the ways of an eternal. Krishna is the soul of all elements. Krishna is the noble of the minds of all elements. Krishna is the soul's self of all elements. Krishna is the inner soul of all elements. Krishna is the internal guide of all elements. Krishna is the cause of the origin of all elements. Krishna is the limit of all good. Krishna is omnipotent. Krishna is the lord of Lakshmi, the presiding deity of all riches. Krishna is the internal guide of all. Krishna is the state ashray of all. Krishna is witness and fear of self.
Krishna as the refuge of the good. Krishna as most difficult to serve. Krishna as the friend of one's heart. Krishna as the beholder of creation. Krishna as beholder, creator and preserver. Krishna as the master of the functions of creation, etc. Krishna is devoid of distinction as of kinship. Krishna is devoid of distinction as between kin and alien. Krishna is wealthy universe created by himself. Krishna is satisfied by the taste of his self-delight. Krishna is the destroyer of the worldly sojourn of his devotees. Krishna is the bearer of body according to his wish. 